I'm Brigham Larson with Brigham Larson Pianos. This piano is gorgeous. This is a 1909 Schoeninger that uh, that we've we've done a complete refinish on the outside, so cosmetically it's beautiful. And then we did only a refurbishing on the inside. We, we've done some things that are more a little bit more drastic, I guess, like we replaced the the keys and the and redid the sharps and the bushings and things. But but for the most part, I would characterize this one as a refurbishing. So some of these others, like uh, like like this one, is is a rebuild. But let's let's check out what I mean. Well, why don't we look at the exterior first, just to kind of take it all in. I think it's so pretty. This veneer and just how it turned out. Of course, the decal here is a replica decal of what was there originally. Schoeninger goes back to the 1870s. Originally, this particular piano, like I said, was was built in the was built in 1909. The year that, uh, that the most pianos were built in the United States was 1911. So this was right before that, the, the tide was still rising at this time. Okay, let's check out the inside. Okay, so what we've done on this piano on the inside is we've reshaped the hammers. We've done a full regulation. Of course, we've, we've cleaned it as well as we can, regulated the, the dampers, regulated the, all of the action. So for example, the distance you can depress the key and the distance that those hammers travel and the distance that they pull off, pull away from the strings right there. All of that is properly regulated back checks we've we did replace the bridle straps those were in uh, in need of, of complete replacement so it's a it's a thorough it's a thorough refurbishing needless to say if you've seen any of my other videos you know that we I speak at length about the uh, effort that we put into these pianos to make them function as well as they possibly can, and this one is is no exception. So let's uh, let's listen to it. That's a that's fun piano play. 
it's it's bright. It has a it has a, a good uh, um, clear tone, and it has good projection. The the action I would say is probably a little bit on the on the lighter side. It's maybe middle of the road, but slightly on the lighter side, easier easier to play, which a lot of people really prefer. Um, but this piano's greatest asset is, I would say, as a community, this piano is a killer. Look at that veneer. I think this piano is so, so beautiful. Anyway, check it out. Hopefully this one fits what you're looking for. If not, lots and lots of other pianos. We restore about 100 pianos a year. and. Uh, and many of those, most of those are for, are for customers. They're, they're old family heirlooms that we restore. But every once in a while, we'll find one like this that we just can't pass up and we have to restore for with the intention of selling. Really like this one a lot. Come check it out, see what you think. Thanks for watching.